Hey, I'm Sapphire. Wanna hear something scary? I'm a 911 operator. The following story comes from the No Sleep subreddit, written by username Higgs Thunder. 911, what is your emergency? Yeah, hi. Um, this is gonna sound kind of strange, but. There's a man stumbling around in circles in my front yard. Um, could you repeat that, sir? Uh, he looks sick or lost or drunk or something. I just woke up to get a glass of water and heard snow crunching around underneath my front window, so I peeked out. I'm looking at him now. He's about 10 yards away from my window. Something's not right. What is your address, sir? Um, 1617 Quarry Lane in Pinella Pass. I'm gonna send a squad car your way, but that's quite a ways out. Are you alone in your house, sir? Yes, I'm alone. Can you confirm that all of your doors and windows are locked? Stay on the phone with me. I know that my front is definitely locked, but I'll go check my back door again really quick. I appreciate your help, by the way. I know this is kind of strange, but I really hope that... Sir, are you still there? He's... he's still in the yard. But he's... what the hell? He's... he's upside down. Sir, stay on with me. What is happening? He's staring right at me, but he's... he's standing on his hands now. He's perfectly still, staring straight at me. He's doing a handstand and he's smiling at me and not moving. He's doing a handstand, sir? I, I don't know how he, yeah, he's he's facing me and standing on his hands and he's got this huge smile and he's perfectly still. What the fuck? Please get someone out here now. Sir, I need you to remain calm. I've put out the call and an officer is on his way. <sighs> his teeth are so huge. Oh my God, please help me. <laughs> Sir, I want you to try and keep an eye on him, but make sure your back door is locked again. We need to make sure all possible access points are secured. Can you talk me through and confirm that your back door is locked? <sighs> okay, I'm walking backwards now, and I'm keeping him in my sight. My hand is on the back door knob now. Okay, it's locked. I need to check the deadbolt, so I'm going to take my eyes off him for a split second. All right, sir. Help is on the way. Just stay on the phone with me. Everything's going to be all right. Sir? Sir, are you still there? He's... his face. It's up against the glass. Sir, I need you to speak up. What is happening? I looked away for a split second and now his face is pressed up against my front window. His teeth are huge. He's still smiling. There's no color in his eyes. Jesus, please help me. Why won't it just fucking move? Sir, I need you to go to the nearest room and lock yourself inside of it. Do you have a basement or a bedroom that you can lock yourself in? He won't stop staring. I think he's gonna hurt me. Sir, I need you to listen to me. Lock yourself somewhere safe until the officer arrives at your house. Can you hear me? Yes. Uh, yes. I'm gonna lock myself in my room. And you're positive that you're alone in your house, correct? Yes. Uh, I'm alone in the house. Wait a moment. He's moving. He's shaking his head. He's telling me no. Oh God, I think he can hear us. He's telling me I'm not alone. Sir, sir, are you still there? Can you still hear me? What was that sound? Is everything okay? Sir? Did you know that fashion is the second most polluting industry in the world? That's pretty scary, right? That's actually one of the many reasons I love to shop secondhand, and my favorite place to do so is on ThreadUp. ThreadUp is the largest online consignment and thrift store. The website is super easy to navigate. You can filter the items by size, style, silhouette. I have a lot of weddings to attend this year, and it was so easy to find amazing dresses at such great prices. I got this Aiden Maddox dress that was originally $395 for only $50. And I can't even tell that these dresses are used, and that's because everything on ThreadUp is hand-inspected and triple-checked for quality. They add over 50,000 new items every single day, so you are guaranteed to find something you'll love. Get an extra 30% off your first order when you go to threadup.com ss or click the link in the description below. Thank you to all of our patrons. If you'd like to join our VIP program, visit patreon.com snarled. 
Want more Something Scary? You can hear more stories over on the Something Scary podcast, available for free on Apple Podcasts or wherever you listen to your favorite shows. The links are in the description below. If you'd like to submit a story, send me an email at somethingscary at snarled.com. Like and share this video if it gave you the chills. And don't forget to subscribe to Snarled and turn on the bell for notifications. And if you dare, follow me on social media. Until next time, sweet dreams.